Hello guys, welcome back to another Ghost Reacts and today we're reacting to another video and that video we are reacting to today is the second part of the Fear Project people that we all know and love over here over on Ghost Reacts. It is the video we are reacting to today is, as I said, the part two, but it is called Satanic Sally House, our Ponte Poltergeist Encounter. So for those of you who are asking for this video, here it is today. I can't wait to get into this one. We all know what to expect. Well, sort of, because it's ghosts. We don't know beyond certain things, but we know little bits of things. But without further ado, let's get straight into it today with this part two of the Sally House with the Project Fear. Let's go. that Sally is not in this house. What? This is gonna be good. Strap in. All right, everybody. Welcome 2 back to Project Fear, part two of the Sally house. If you haven't seen the first one, please. I'm so excited for this. That one. We had the most insane start to an overnight that we've ever had. From the second we walked into this door, we've had something happen non-stop. And now we're at the point where one of us is going to be spending a lot of time alone oh. in the basement. Oh. The basement is where the pentagram is. The basement is where the demonic entity seems to have come I can't from. wait for this video. It's so good. I love these. It's terrible. Sam and Colby as well was so good. I need to get back to reactions to them as well. I did a poll. The poll was, I will be using this poll later tonight. Choose wisely. And I let our Fear Club members decide who is going down there tonight. <laughs> That's what the poll was. That was what the poll mm. was. No. Yeah. Who is it then? So, let me pull it up. At 8% of the votes... The Fear Club voted Chelsea, so she is safe. Oh, okay. Loving Fear Club. Yeah. The Thank you. Next person who had the least amount of votes at 19% was Alex. Alex, you're safe. Nice. Damn it. Let's go. And now we'll it's going to be the other guy, and it's not going to be the guy with the glasses. Time down in the basement with a whopping 49% of the total votes <laughs> the fear club has decided they have spoken that dakota is going to be spending a lot of time in the basement <laughs> why fear club no, baby. why was it he's a being punished 50 percent <laughs> I'm upset with you, but I still love you. Yeah, I don't get why you. I've, been, I've suffered enough. No, screw that, dude. You literally had, like, the only time you've ever had anything up to fate go to you is never. Yeah, because me and the universe are on great terms. <laughs> I don't know about you fuckers. <laughs> well, this is just the only way we could get you, I guess. Let's so go. A lot of voted you. <laughs> Oh God. Honestly, just another reason to join the Fear Club because you get to decide our nights. Yep. Yeah, there's there's a lot of pull there. You just put Dakota in the basement. Dakota in the basement. Dakota in the basement. Yeah. Look at you, yeah. buddy. How long? How long do I have to be down there? Um, I think like most of the rest of the night. Dude, what? Yes. No. Yes, there is a lot of time left. We have a wow. lot of time to kill. Alex, Chelsea, and myself, we're going to be exploring the rest of the Sally house. Kind of just follow up on what we got from the beginning of the night in part one. Mm. In no and I keep saying it. Too. This is going to be no so good. We've already just started the video. No this entire time. It adds to the creepiness, adds to the scare factor. Yeah. You better, like, scream loud if something happens so we can get the heck out of this house. <laughs> I won't say shit. 
<laughs> I'm going to summon another demon. I'm going to become a full Satanist tonight. Oh. And just bring demons all up in here. Imagine. Yep. All right, well. Skedaddle. It's time to bundle up and get in the basement. Hey, if this video gets 75,000 likes, Chelsea's going to come back to the Sally house all by herself for an entire night. All right, 75,000. Chelsea will do an overnight by herself at the Sally house. Wow. All right, let's, let's get it. Let's go. I'll let's be down for that video. Wouldn't mind watching that. That'd be sick. Let me know if it actually has happened and I'll get on to reacting to it. You got it. No. I need to watch Sam and Colby's Sally oh. House because I know they've been here as well. Yeah, dude. Right, dude. So if you're interested right. in that, let me know in the it's comments like... below and I'll get on to reacting no. to that as well. <laughs> <laughs> that is disgusting. What cobwebs? Spider eggs on this Spider chair. eggs. I've never seen spider eggs in my life. Sally's room to start. We have a new device, a couple new devices that we want to test out. <laughs> They're walking so loud up there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sitting in that chair. There's so many spider eggs. Not today. Yeah, I wouldn't do that either. Not today. Fuck that. Throwing a mask on because it's really dusty mm. down here. I don't want to get dust in my Look after your health Thanks first. Thanks for making this possible. I want to show you guys how dark it is. So for you guys, it's gonna be pitch black. Really bright. Well, that's because it's filming in night vision. This is what my, I'm seeing right now. Pitch black. Nothing. It's so dark. I can't even see that static that you're seeing. Right see, now. when they do this type of stuff where you can't see anything, how do they navigate if they can't see anything? Is my question. Please let me know in the comments below because I have no clue how they navigate in this darkness if they have no light. I just see darkness, but with night vision, you guys can see everything. And I can't. Okay, well, I'm in the basement right now. Just sat down on a chair that's on top of the pentagram. You know what? I'm gonna Google something really quick. How to summon a demon to mess with my friends. <laughs> hmm, how to summon a demon step by step. No, screw yeah, don't I'm do that. that. <laughs> don't mess oh. with that shit. Is we all know don't mess with stuff like that. Me? I'm literally losing my voice, you guys. If this evil thing, this evil entity, this demon that's here, is especially if you don't know what you're right doing, now, so dangerous. You, this was not my choice. If it was up to me, we wouldn't even be here tonight. Like normally, we don't like to mess with demonic stuff, and now they got me. Wow. I just heard something move back there. Hmm. There's nothing there. Not yet, anyway. If there's a demon here, I know you don't usually take requests. Can you go up <laughs> like a DJ for the rest of the night? <laughs> there's three people up there. <laughs> So we are officially back up in Sally's room. We have some new devices that we want to test out. We have a brand new REM pod. I'm going to get out of IR just to show how awesome this is. Look at this. Look at this. We went to a convention and one of our awesome fans gave us this custom made 3D printed REM pod. Dude, show him the button. <laughs> He's on his butt hole. <laughs> yeah, I'll turn it off if you know what I mean. <laughs> yep, that is the magic button. <laughs> and then we also have this. This is a REM pod as well. Yeah, teddy bear REM pods. This I love these. Teddy bear. I feel like this They're is a really little things. appropriate like, spot to keep these because there's already so many toys in here. Alright, if there is anyone with us, can you please come into this room? We have two toys for you to play with. Sally, if you can hear my voice, can you come up to the second floor? There's 
Sally, do you want to come and play in here with us? Or any, any spirits in here, do you want to come in here and make one of these devices go off? All you have to do is walk past them. I'm gonna whip out the PS device right now. This was working for us earlier. We were getting very direct communication from whatever it is that's here. Something upstairs was talking to us earlier and it said it was a six-year-old girl named Sally, which is the girl who died here. Even though what we were talking to earlier identified itself as Sally, we're still very skeptical that it is her, the six-year-old girl who died here. Just because of how much came through, how much intelligent communication came through, it really didn't feel like a six-year-old girl. It felt like something- I like his shit. I know it's off topic, but I really like his shoes. I'm going to turn on the PS device, though. This is a device that has a word database inside of it. So I'm going to turn this on and see if I can get something down here to talk to me. Even though I really don't freaking want to right now, I'm so scared. Like, this is so terrifying. Oh, I feel you, bro. I feel you. you I'd be shitting myself, but I still do it. Can you tell me who's here? Is there really something demonic down here or in this house? What do you think about me being cellar? Cellar! Ooh. Just said cellar! Yes, I'm in the cellar, I'm in the basement. Fuck! That sounded like a hiss. That it was like a pipe? it was like a snake like a hiss. hiss. It sounded like a... Yes, I'm in the cellar, I'm in the basement. It sounded like a snake yes, hiss. I'm in the cellar, I'm in the basement. Did something bad happen down here? Or gas escaping pipe, as he said. Were these rituals that happened down here worse than we think? Was there something summoned here? Dig? Hurt. Hurt. Dig and then hurt. Weird words to here? say. Did something bad happen down here? Wouldn't expect that Is to be something said. something summoned here? My interpretation of that is like someone was buried down here. Cut. Cut. Just said cut. Ooh. Who was cut? Who was hurt? That's like a very sacrificial yeah. word, like cut. Yeah. Who am I talking to? Who's down here with me? Do you have a name or something you like to be called? We're starting to believe that you take the form of Sally, the little girl, just to build people's trust. Is that what you do? Do you act like you're Sally? I would believe so. What are you? Why do you seem to feed off of fear? I really don't even want to ask certain questions or push it too far, but I probably have to. You always have to in these types of situations, though. So. Here, you're gonna have to scare me out. I shouldn't have said nope. that. Nope. <laughs> Dear God, if you're listening right now, I just pray that you protect me, keep me safe. I do not want to be here, and I know that this is wrong. I know I shouldn't be sitting on this pentagram, but I pray that you just protect me and keep me safe. I feel so vulnerable just sitting with my back to the basement. Yeah, because as we saw earlier, there's a little cutout in the side, isn't there, where they can walk through. I almost want to like spread some of these things out. Like, I love the way they like, edit these as well. It's the so good. Here, the duck in that room. I want to get some tips. <laughs> next to the stairs and see if it'll push stuff. Just booby trap this upstairs. Booby trap everything. Let's just put the duck in the closet. Yeah. I'm gonna put it right in the middle of the tea set. I just put the duck pod into this closet where it said that toys would move on its own and form a circle. Al, where'd you put the ball? Yeah, the ball is right on the edge of the staircase. Okay. And then we put the little boo bear right in the middle. Little so boo bear. Touches it, that will light up. And then maybe we just go into this room right here and we can do a digital recorder session. <laughs> 
the spare bedroom. So I have a digital recorder in my hands. This is a device Tape move location. That sounds that we can't hear from Sally's room to the spare bedroom. Ears. It is said that spirits are able to speak in those frequencies. So we're going to start asking some questions and hopefully get a verbal response. SS method is a perfect thing for these types of things. I don't know why they're not doing it. Up here with us right now. As you know, I'm very supportive of the Estes method. If you watch my videos, it's one of my favorite methods. We really do not believe that you are the spirit of a little girl. Can you say something to us that will convince us otherwise? You've made your presence known this entire night. You've made us go up and down stairs. You've turned on the TV. You've led us into the basement. Now Dakota's down there by himself. Should we be worried? Are you going to do something to him? Possibly. It's not a good sign. What the fuck? What the? Guys, I'm hearing something. What is that? I just heard something come from this freaking hole in the wall. It sounded like these branches in there. Something just moved in there. Could be an animal. Go check on him, quickly. Coming down. What's up, what's up, what's up? Guys, it said demon. It said no demon? Way. Like, no joke, I heard like something moving in there. I got up and went over there and then it said demon. Oh, Are you demon. kidding me? And I was asking it earlier to like identify itself. You know what's even more messed up? That we haven't reviewed the tape at all, but the last quote, I literally just got done saying, are you going to do anything to Dakota? He's down in the basement. No way. I mean, the timing of all that stuff happening is insane. We should review the digital recorder. Wow. That question that we asked right before you freaked out it was about you. I can't wait to see if they captured anything on this recorder. <laughs> Not really anything right now. Dude, that's so creepy. Yeah. Even though there was no response, yeah. you literally just asked, like inquired about me, and then it, it came through to me and scared me. Like, quite literally, we asked that question. That is weird. And not even two seconds later, we're going. Shut what was that? Up. Is that the walkie? That's the walkie. <laughs> Shut the fuck, dude. Shut up. What is that? I don't know. What does that mean? Someone's trying to come through. That's what that means. Something's trying to come through? You're, it's Something is talking to you through that, like another walkie is coming through. I don't even have a walkie. This, you you didn't grab walk. one? No, I don't have You a didn't walkie. grab a walkie? And that's my fault. I forgot to tell you to grab one. You told me, I just forgot. Okay, but what is freaking happening? I don't know. 
Yeah, what the hell? Try talking. Hello? Dude. Dude, that is that. weird. You can't even change channels, dude. You can't change channels? What? On this channel. Oh, How? Not. How is that even possible? Trying to change channels. It is completely locked. Okay, you're doing the call, Matt. Trying to call. Dude. We've heard weird static come through our lockies, but we've never had a call. I would go check the other walkie yeah, if I was them. We can't even change channels. Who's that? that was like a something trying to come through. Is there someone trying to make communication with us? Is this the demon? Very, very weird. This is so weird. Can I turn this off? Yeah. I think we just tapped into like the other side via walkie. Yeah. Okay, so recapping of what just happened. I've got goosebumps right now from this. Session. Are you going to do something to Dakota? Dakota, you start wandering around to look at that hole. You get demon, and you've been getting all these other violent words. I heard something come from the hole. Go over there. As I get right next to it, it says demon. That's actually disturbing. I'll give it one more shot down here, but if, if this keeps going on, I don't know how long I can do this. Like, seriously. And, and like, that's fine. I mean, the challenge is to be down here by yourself. This isn't project torture so yeah like if something crazy happens you need us yell for us safety like, we'll comes first bro in possible. any situation safety always comes first you your walkie now but you probably don't no do i don't want a walkie <laughs> i'm not taking a walkie now all right we're gonna go back upstairs what floor are you guys on we're on the top floor so you can hear me if i scream yeah yeah yeah, yeah. all right buddy good luck thank you i feel sorry for dakota being down there on his own i wouldn't want to leave him on his own That's where you get the activity for. I haven't gotten a word since they came down. Let's go upstairs. Let's do a proper. He might have gone back up with them then. That if that's the case, or it. We well, don't know if it's a gender or anything like that. Balls down a step. The balls on the first step. Like think about it. If it would have fell, it would have rolled all the way down. This is on the second step now. If this is right here and it falls, Al is gonna come all the way down to you. Dude. Like, there's just no way it goes down one step. I don't understand how the ball Odd. would get dropped and only go down one step. I don't know. It's almost like it was placed. I mean, the thing with the accounts here. Oh, he's wearing the same shoes as well. I'm going to have to get myself a pair of these shoes. They look bit and really nice. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know. Like, that is weird that it's on the first step. Didn't fall all the way down. But, like, we ran down in a panic. We could have kicked it. We could have moved it. We're stepping right over where the ball was. Yeah. It could have barely shifted the floorboard and just dropped it down one. I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I get what you're They're saying. They're trying to come like, up with like. see it happen. And I don't want to jump to that conclusion. And then all of a sudden we look back at the edit and go, oh my God. Like they're, they're, they're looking at reasons for it to like responsibly think, responsibly thinking about like things that they could like try and disprove any ghost stuff as every ghost hunter should in my opinion should try and disprove what they're hearing and things like that to see if it's legitimate and if you can't think of anything that will disprove it it might actually be true so yeah that's why i like people like this who actually look for reasonable doubt and if there's no reasonable doubt then you've got really no other option but to start believing in this shit <laughs> excuse my language <laughs> Yeah. You're right. I mean, we have no solid proof, no solid evidence. Either like, way, we'll know creepy. It. Yeah, we'll very it. creepy. It's weird that it was on that, and if we didn't, and it didn't light up, and we didn't move it, then that's super weird. Just... What, what was that? What was that? That sounded like a police siren. Dude, that was a fucking little girl. That was like a girl's laugh. No, that sounded like a police what siren. We don't know. Did you, did you hear that laugh? No, I just heard you guys freak out. What the f was that? I just. 
That sounded like a police what siren, like pulling up. Just. What, what was that? What was that? What was that? I don't know if that was a laugh or a scream, but it sounded like a little kid. Is there someone outside? No. There's no one out here. Dude, it's almost four in the morning. Yeah, Dude, there should be like, no one out no at, one at out this here. time. I don't get that. That was the creepiest sound I've ever heard. I am, though, sometimes, kid, depending on child. things. <laughs> I think they just went outside. What brought you down here? Why are you here? Psychic. Ooh. It just said psychic. I just asked what brought you here, and it said psychic. Like there was literally, when there was a family living here who got scared out, they brought in a psychic who told them that there is something evil here. What did the psychic mm. have to do with this? I feel really weak right now. Like really weak. I know oh, I feel you, bro. Right, but I'm like... Totally gosh, feel you. I actually feel like kind of nauseous too. Mm. Like your energy's been like sapped. Toxic it's draining right your energy, bro. That's what it's doing. Sick. Are you doing something to me right now? He's draining your energy, lad. That's what they do. Are you trying to affect me? Soon. Soon? What's gonna happen soon? That's like a warning. I hate that. <laughs> I don't know. That was weird. That was really, really weird. Definitely one of the weirdest videos I've reacted to. For ghost act for ghost activity that is as well. Again. It's locked, Chelsea. You see someone? There's no one out there. There's no one there. There's no one out there. There's no one out there. If you remember part one, the they were hearing um crackling doors as well. I thought it was the basement door. Um, not the front door because the front door's like locked and padlocked and not padlocked like key coded lock type thing so no one can open the door if it's locked unless you know the code so from part one i did think it was the basement door which i still think it could be they they're just not thinking with it if you get what i mean what the f is happening we just heard someone walk up to the front door looked out the window and no one's there I don't think it's the front door. I really don't. I think there's a door they're not looking at. Or it's the basement. One or the other. We are hearing children laughing. We're hearing voices. And someone just walked up to the front door, pushed on it, and there's no one there. We had the door open earlier. Yeah, that's true. Someone opened up the front door earlier. Dude, something Part one. is happening right now. If you go back You're and watch my first reaction, you'll see it. Foot away from the door and something pushed on it. There, there's no chance that that was a person. I don't like what's going on up there. Like they're about up with together and they're terrified. It's very weird. I feel so vulnerable down here. I don't believe it's the front door though. Like, what is it trying to hide up there? Or why is it trying to keep us down here? Is it trying to manipulate us and try to get us closer and closer to the basement as well? I mean, it just got us down there. Don't even have an idea of what it's trying to do. You even think about this, like we're hearing the voices right where you're standing, Al, and if you go straight down, right here, you guys, is the pentagram. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Go back up. Let's do this digital recorder session. I'm gonna have the ball back up on top. Nowhere near the ledge. It's yeah. a couple inches away. I think this is the last room they have upstairs. What the? What the hell? Stairs, and I watched it get pushed. Did you catch it on camera? Yes, I got it like midway through the fall. What the f What the f What the 
Heck, you guys. I have never That's seen that with my own eyes. I've very never weird. Seen one of those actually go off. Oh my goodness. They get pushed down the stairs. I heard it get pushed before it hit the first step. Like I'm not kidding. I heard it get yeah, pushed. You, and then you saw the light. And then it hit and fell down. Oh my gosh. We have not made it upstairs successfully. What no, the hell? It's bringing us downstairs, man. It that means yeah, there so, reason, it's hiding I don't something. Yeah, I feel like we have to be up there though. Like if it doesn't want us up there, we need to be up yeah, there. Yeah, it's hiding right. something you know, if that's the right. case. Now, why are we listening to it? Okay, this is actually like messed up. Usually, you're, you're, like, that's an understatement. may happen during an entire night and we've had like 10 things happen. Bro, the, the most active house I've like, seen right now. The most. This is the most other than the Conjuring house and the ever seen in one night. museum that I've reacted and, to. Uh, like, it does all this stuff when we're not paying attention. I know. It has caught us. If you're interested in those, go have a look at those as well. Apparently, because they, they are good videos. Ball. Falling? We're going down the stairs? Dark. Dark. I know you're dark. I know you're evil. You've already told me. Something you're is demon. definitely there. Now I'm 100% convinced that Sally is not in this. Yeah, house. she's. It's no. Just you. Something evil. Something demonic. Yeah. Definitely. Dark. Definitely. Did this pentagram that I'm sitting on, did it bring you here? Legit, I've got goosebumps right now. Let me know if you've got goosebumps. Because, bro, it feels so weird having goosebumps when I'm watching videos like this. <laughs> don't believe that. The psychic is the one who picked up uh, on you. He didn't bring you here. Who brought you here? Oh, whoa, I have a wicked headache. Whoa. All right, start to leave the basement. Don't stay there no more. It's draining your energy, bro. Trying to, like, keep my nerves calm. Like, I'm getting, like, hot and cold flashes. Yeah, it's like draining your energy. I would leave. Oh, I start feeling like this, I would leave immediately. Ain't have enough, no bad demons taking my energy, bro. Terrible gut feeling. Like when we first got to the Sally house, I was getting a headache. But now that I'm down here, like I'm getting symptoms of like an actual sickness. I could literally just be getting sick. The timing is really weird. I have to keep clearing my throat. I'm losing, like, my voice. I can hardly scream. I can only talk. Are you trying to affect me? Are you trying to hurt me? Are you offended that I'm sitting on the pentagram? Or at least what the pentagram used to be? Oh, my gosh, dude. My arm is so weak, I can hardly hold the camera. I would right leave, now. bro. This is getting dangerous if you're starting to feel like this. i sick right now, or something is happening. It's... I would get checked out by a medical professional if this is happening to me. Let's try this again. If you're feeding that type of stuff, it's I'm not good. Been this, before. this is this is so much crap. So freaking scary. Rolling on the digital recorder on the second floor. They should really have a medical person the with them. Room, at least at least bedroom. one. We've heard a little girl laughing and a little girl talking. Just for precaution. We watched you push a ball down the stairs. Can you tell us who you are? Can you give us a name? Are you a demon? Are you the demon that's been messing with us all night? Do you not want us in this house anymore, or are you trying to keep us here? Why do you hurt people? Why do you scratch people? Why are you choking people? Keep burping. 
literally I've had this happen to me before, like Crescent Sanatorium, and it's not a good feeling. Like I actually think something's doing this to me. I, I'm not surprised this is happening. Like I'm sitting on a freaking pentagram right now. Even though I'm feeling stuff, I'm feeling sick. It's really suspiciously quiet now. I'm getting no words. Quiet. Quiet. What? First word he's had in ages. Finished. What wow. Jesus starts talking out of nowhere like that. Are you telling me to be quiet, or are you saying that you're being quiet? You be quiet. <laughs> You're straining your energy, bro, is what he's doing. That's why it's saying you to be quiet so it can focus. It says quiet, like it's listening to me. Are you telling me to be quiet? Am I alone now? Why did you go quiet? Stare. 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 S-T-A-I-R. The bull? Are you on the stair? The bull? Where they were earlier? Did you say stair? S T A I R. Upstairs, okay, or is it in the basement stairs? stairs? I can just see it through my We don't know. Here, which is not even turn. Literally, you guys, this is what my eyes see. That's Again, I don't know how they navigate. I don't have night vision, unfortunately, with my human eyes. It is so dark. I can only see the stairs if I look at my camera screen. Oh, so they're Literally using the cameras to navigate. Sally okay, that makes more sense. If you want me to leave, can you say the word Sally again on this? Portal. Portal. Is that what this pentagram is? Is a portal? It would make a lot of sense why there's something evil here. It's usually what pentagrams do. Is this a portal? Is this basement a portal? Did you come straight from hell? If you say the word Sally again, I will just leave. If you want me out of here so bad, if you want us to leave, just say Sally one more time and I'm out of here. That's the word. This earlier tonight when we were as a group, the PS device said Sally after it said six years and girl, which was the age of Sally when she died here. But we don't think it's Sally. There's no way a six year old girl is doing some of the yeah, things that we've experienced. There's no way. Tonight. There's no way what we're experiencing. It'd be a bit more positive. It wouldn't Sally. be just negative. And most of the stuff that's happened so far tonight is trying to scare us. I don't know why she would want to scare us. And maybe she's here, but she's definitely not the one coming through. Pretty deep questions. Let's see what we got. Rolling up the jittery corner on the second floor in the main room, the main bedroom. We've heard a little girl laughing and a little girl talking. We watched you push a ball down the stairs. Can you tell us who you are? Can you give us a name? It was like something being said. I heard like before that, when you asked like, are you a demon or whatever? I heard, I'm just Sally, I told you. Are you a demon? Are you a demon? I've been messing with us all night. Are you not okay. Stretch, but I... Yeah, it, it could be a stretch, yeah, it really could be that. but Whereas, again, it's playing the game where it's there is definitely a response. Just you just have to listen to it very carefully. Do you not want to 
Oh. It's definitely a response. Not a girl Again, I do recommend girl, using headphones you would if you want to hear that. stuff like this. I have some weird whisper in this next question, mm. but I don't know yeah, what there is it is. Yeah. There's a communication there. You can hear it. It's just hard to make out. Does it stay here? Does that stay here? Stay here? And like the that might be a, the final word, not just a, a yell, but like there might be that might be a word, but it's just so loud. Not in this house anymore, or are you trying to keep us here? So it's trying to get trying to communicate. This house. It's trying to get them to stay here. It's demonic. It wants your soul. It doesn't want you to leave. It wants your soul. Like it latches on like a leash. Yeah. That's the only thing I can think of is if it, if this is demonic, it wants us to stay because of that reason. It doesn't want us to stay because it likes us. No, it wants something more than that. I'm really starting to get 4:41 a.m. here. Me too. I feel like the more this night has gone on, the more evident it's become that this is not. Oh insane. yeah, yes, this definitely. I agree sort of on that. Spirit, some sort of evil spirit. Right. This isn't Sally. This is satanic. Yeah. I think maybe we go get Dakota and mm -hmm. we do a spirit box session all together. We know that whatever it is can like manipulate and use electronics. Mm -hmm. So, like, I do think the spirit box would be a good option. Spirit to box out. time. So, we are going to do a spirit box session that rapidly scans through a oh, bunch Yeah, this of is very waves. loud. Yeah, we know for sure that whatever is. If you're not using um, headphones, it's very loud. Manipulating electronics. Yes. I mean, and even the speaker behind Alex, people say it goes off and on, just like the TV. So, something here can manipulate these types of frequencies clearly. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try it. Give it a shot. Dude! So a walkie just went off. Whoa. That was the walkie? That was the walkie. That beep? Yeah. What the hell? That was turned no. off. Are you messing with the walkie right now? In the basement? That was definitely in the basement. We got that you want us to stay here on the digital recorder. Why do you want us to stay in this house? What did you tell me that you were in the basement? Oh, hang on. That's our response. That yeah, there was, was yeah. Is that coming from the basement yeah. door? Yeah. Did you just knock on the basement door? <laughs> oh, with a laugh. With a laugh. With a laugh. There was a laugh. With a laugh. With a laugh. It almost sounded like the laugh that we heard. Yeah. What the yeah. hell? Why do you want us in the basement so bad? Deep voice. We all believe that you've been trying to get us in the basement this entire night. And now you just knocked on the basement door. Why is that? Whoa. Whoa. I, I want you forever. I, 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 I want you forever. What does that mean? What do you want from us? Whoa. I was feeling sick downstairs. Who is it or what is it that does that to people here, that hurts people here?
provide. 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 You provide what? What do we provide? Self. Self. The soul? Or self. It was one of the two. The soul or self? Because it just said you will provide. The little girl who died here, what's her name? Sally is actually the demon. Is that true? No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Right after you ask, ask, we believe that Sally's the actual demon. It says, no, you don't. Well, we do. That's what we believe. We don't believe Sally is actually here. We believe that you're trying to pretend that you are Sally. Just admit it. Tell us your name. Me. No, that sounded like a little girl. Me? Me? Dude, it sounded sound like, uh, me? Bro. Like a little girl. <laughs> like, yeah, we know you're manipulating us. We know that you're not really a little girl. <laughs> It was a fud. Hey, turn it off, turn it off. Turn the thing off. What was that? Something just made a shadow on the door, and then I just heard, heard a knock. Huh, look outside the window. I don't see anything. Dude. This is so yeah. weird. It went from left to right, and then all of a sudden, there was a knock on the door. <laughs> I heard the knock. Whoa, what the? Whoa, what the? <gasps> is that in here? The red pod. Guys, what the frick? It always happens in like waves. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. Dude, my like fear levels, like my adrenaline has never been so triggered. Dude, I'm telling you, when something happens in this house, it is like full send. All hell breaks loose. Aim your face. I'm like starting not to like I'm starting to feel nauseous. I'm nauseous too. Yeah, like I actually feel gross right now. Dude, I hate this place. This is the most things that we've experienced ever in, in one place. 100%. This has been insane, this video. We know you want us to stay. We don't know why, but we're about to leave. So if you want us to stay, you got to do something big to let us know you're in here. Yeah, they don't. Dude, they don't just go off either. The hell though. I'm gonna reset it. Dude, my chest is starting to hurt. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's starting to mess with us, like physically. Now. It's this is sound like Dude, that chest hurt and stuff like that is anxiety per like caused. So if their anxiety could be going through the roof right now. That's why they're feeling pain. Yeah. My chest. Yeah, anxiety. Dude, I get that a I, lot. I keep resetting it, and then it just like something is standing right here. 
But that ain't normal. Dude, I don't know. I'm gonna turn it off. Okay. All right, it's off. Okay. 556, no, 5.36, should I say, AM. The timing of that was weird. Like, really weird. Even though it wasn't big. I mean, dude, this is literally like it hurts where my cross yeah. angles. No, for yeah. real. Like it's the point where my cross touches my skin is where, like, inside of my chest hurts. I feel like we're just like swimming with sharks right now. Yes, I know. This is a nightmare location. I'm not gonna lie. When we first pulled up, I'm like, okay, I feel really gross. I don't feel good, but I'm like, this is manageable. But it has been the most eventful night. This place. Understatement. Part one was crazy. Part two is even more crazy as as we're watching now. If you haven't seen part one, I beg you go watch part one because part one is so good as well. It is interesting. I do think the pentagram is almost directly above this area over here. It is. It is. It's like right where that chair is. That's the staircase right there. Go down and hook a quick left and it's like right there. That's the pentagram. Can you imagine if it's standing right in front of them and they All wouldn't right, we're know? Leaving. We don't want to be here anymore. You're going to have to do something to keep us here. Again. Can you turn on the TV again? I think they're done. I don't think they're getting anything else. They got more than enough though. And before it turns into something physical. Yeah. We should get out. Yep, definitely. I agree on that. Uh, video I've just reacted to. Like, thank you for the suggestion on this video for part one and part two. Um, both did not let down. Oh my God. Please let me know your opinions in the comments below. What you think of all you've seen in the part one and part two. Um, what your opinions are. Um, what you feel on my opinions, on their opinions, etc. Oh, any more videos, please let me know in the comments also. But yeah, if you did like this video, please smash the like button also. As well as, if you're not a subscriber, Smash the subscribe button as well. The cage bells been up and done up well, such as these ones and my gaming videos at the weekend. Still on Suicide Squad. Um, trust me, I will be getting around to doing more of those because I've been ill, as I said in my last video. So I'm going to try and do as best as I can to get on top of the gaming reactions. And if there is anything else you'd like to see me do at all, please let me know in the comments below and I'll see if I can expand the channel even more. Because, like I've told you, I'm trying, I'm going to. And by the end of the year, I'm going to at least start trying to develop my own animated series for a YouTube thing for people to watch on there as well. Um, but yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below on that as well. Um, but yeah, I love these two videos. They were so good. A lot of footage was captured. A lot of stuff was captured. It just makes me believe in this other realm that we haven't seen and we can't see. Well, some people can't see certain things. Um, but yeah, uh, I feel really lucky <laughs> that uh, I wasn't in that house. <laughs> but I would, like, again, I would be scared, but I would want to do it just because I want to try and prove that, type, that side. There is stuff after death. There is something after death. It's not just this life and death. That's not it. That's not possible. I don't feel like that's... It's not just... There has to be a reason why we're here. Do you know what I mean? There has to be. But yeah, like I said, let me know your opinions down below. Um, and I will see you in my next video, which will be a... I don't know yet. I just have to figure out what the audience wants to see, and then we'll get on to it. But until then, I will see you next time. Good mate.